Hey everyone, welcome back to another Canterbury Bosses Survive. Today we are checking out the OP Fist from the OP Punch Mod. Most OP Punch ever? That's a bold claim right there. As you can see, it does a lot of damage and it also says might lag. So keep that in mind throughout this video. That, you know, it might get a little lagging here. Let's see how the weapon works though. We are over here at the dummies. Let's see it in action here. Now, do I need to actually like get up close and punch something? absolutely not it shoots like a million fists oh my god okay i get the lag part there's literally just a ring of fists that's pretty cool i like that it's different from our old fist that we have seen in videos where we punch things you know instead of punching things this time we're summoning fists but yeah let us get to it king slime you know i saw a funny comment the other day somebody was like i'm waiting for the day when king slime survives i don't think that day will ever come i'm gonna be honest maybe eternity mode king slime i don't know I don't know. But yeah, let's get through it. Let's go through all these guys here. Ayaka Thulu, get him before he runs away. Queen Bee, get her before she runs away. She usually doesn't run away. Now, the thing about the fist is like they legitimately go through everything. So when I was testing it, just, you know, a quick test, it was definitely opening up some beehives. You can see, oh, I think I just saw like one of the projectiles fly through here because the lights of the caves were changing. But yeah, boom, Brandy Cthulhu should be a one hit. And it was beautiful. You love to see it. Let's head over here, aka where I love to just fight Lepus and Turkor and the Eater because, you know, I have to be over here for the Eater. I think, I don't know, actually. I, I haven't really tested Eater. Whoa, did you see that? A wild fist just came that way. Yo, was that a fist that we tested over here and it came all the way down here? That's pretty crazy. All right, let's fight the Dark Mage. Boom, and we're heading to hell let's put some new boxes down here hmm, where should i put some this time let's put some right here wall of flesh meet the flying fist i'll be surprised how far we get with this fist because there's no way we have three episodes in a row right where a weapon kills everything there's no way there's there's no way literally three episodes in a row i don't think that's ever happened let alone two episodes we just had two episodes let's really quickly do the dungeon guardian here boom and this will honestly show if this fist is going to go far or not oh yeah hate to see it all right other than the dungeon guardian though i don't expect these guys to survive especially a giant circle of fists yep nice and easy same thing with a plantar and the golem maybe the dungeon guardian wouldn't survive whoa 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 here come the fist maybe the dungeon guardian wouldn't survive if we didn't have calamity installed maybe it's a high possibility, honestly. But yeah, Plantera, Golem, get him out of here. It's always funny seeing the fish just fly past me. But yeah, let's fight Duke Fishron. Boom. And just because I'm feeling like fighting the old Duke, let's do it. Why not? Why not? What's up, old Duke, my boy? It doesn't seem like he's eating these fists, which is uh, a little, I'm not going to lie, a little upsetting that he's not eating these fists. This is fun, like, playing the game at, like, 5 FPS a second. All right, he died. I'll consider that a W. He died. There was no hard damage cap. He died. We fought the old Duke for once in two episodes. I think last episode we fought it just for fun. But there you go. Old Duke. Right now, let's take on Akram. What's up, Akram? Okay, he died. Let's take on the Martian Saucer here. I don't really expect any vanilla boss to do anything. Again, like I said, if we probably didn't have the Calamity mod installed, we probably would have killed the Dungeon Guardian. Possibly. But yeah, let's go ahead. Let's run through all these event bosses here. I accidentally spawned the Ever Scream down here. Did he despawn? Wow, he was off screen for like half a second and he despawned. All right, we got the three bosses here. Boom. Whoa, hold up. How did they survive? Is it because they're stacked on top of each other? That might have been it right there. Because I bet if we just summon them in solo. Whoa, hold up. We got some survivors? What the heck? I thought it was because they're stacked up, but they honestly might be surviving. Maybe it's because their health is really high. This weapon only does 100k damage. Huh. That could be possible. Bone Pump King. Oh my god. Okay, hold up. I gotta grab him and like hit him a bunch before he runs away. Again, sorry for like the lag this episode. I, I kind of can't control that. Ice Queen. She's trying to run away and she got away somehow. All right, boom. Got her this time. She like, okay, we got her, we got her. She like tries to run away, like whatever like side is closer to get off camera. It's kind of annoying. All right, for some reason, the boys aren't here. That's all good. We'll summon the boy. Quickly hit her with a thousand fists. And now, okay, the pillars did spawn. Just, just make it sure. Honestly, the pillars, if I sit here, you think one of the fists will come over here? <laughs> yes, sir. They did come over here. All right. What if I sit at this one? You think the fists are still coming? Hey, they're still going, bro. This is amazing. What about this one? Damn, they're still coming. Okay, that was beautiful. That was, 
I take everything back I said about the fish. It might be a little weak, but that was amazing right there. All right, while we wait for the Moon Lord, let's fight Abyssion. Why not? We're going to hit up with a bunch of fish since they're all right on top of me. Oh, one of them, two of them did survive. Okay. All right, Moon Lord. Let's see if we can get that top eye. Oh, we got the top eye. There we go. All right, so let us take on the Dream Eater. Boom, Dream Eater, what's up? will you die I, I probably should get like as close as possible against bosses so that they get hit by a bunch of fists at once is it dead it's dead right <laughs> yeah, yeah okay all right let us fight the mutant next what is up my boy hold up he's kind of hard to get close to get over here no just summon in the fist he's gonna get a little laggy just summon in the fist i believe in the fist okay he's taking like zero damage hold up hold up I'm point blank on him. All right, yeah, that's not working out on him. All right, let us fight dog. I honestly don't expect the fist to get too far now, but you never know. You never know. Okay, it's doing damage. It actually did damage, which is honestly impressive. There you go. We killed dog. A little laggy again. To be expected this whole entire episode. <laughs> the fist itself did say that it was going to lag. Boom, let's punch dog in the face a couple thousand times, however many fists it spawns in when you punch him. The game is extremely laggy right now, like I can barely move type stuff. We killed him though. I, I take back everything I said about this fist, like it actually killed dog. Might have been slow, might have been laggy, but a dog kill is a dog kill. And I didn't have to sit there for like an hour just slowly whittling away at it. It is time to fight jungle Dargan. Oh, am I not in the jungle? Let's get it. Don't know how this fight's gonna go. It might be another fairly slow fight. That's actually not that bad. If I could just like time the angle right, like we could do a nice bit of damage here. All right, we got him in the phase two. Didn't take that long at all. This definitely has to go down as one of the louder bosses in Terraria modding history. And he is dead. There we go. Let's get on to the next fight. The fight I hate the most. Hey, what's up? Can I move you around? <laughs> okay, I don't think it's gonna kill Sepulcher. Oh my god. I don't know if you guys heard that, but my headphones literally just exploded right there. All right, find Supreme Cal. Let's get it. How long is this going to take? Okay, it's going to take a good while. I don't feel like sitting through this uh, for obvious reasons. I, I could sit through the dog one. I could sit through the yarn one, but uh, I don't know about this one. This one seems like it might take too long it's actually really not that bad in terms of damage like we're actually getting somewhere but like we can consider this a partial w because it, it will kill her it just will take a minute all right let's take on the eidolon worm here and then we can fight knuckles and Ek death of course eidolon worm i do not expect any success here i'll be 100 percent honest yeah, it doesn't seem like we're going to do much. All right, let's see the Knuckles. Of course, I got to bring in the uh, national treasure. And let's see it in action here. Boom. Hey, what's up? How you doing? Don't kill me. Let me kill you. Okay, it's fine. All right, I don't expect much from the Ek Death fight either. If that's what happened with the Knuckles fight. Well, I don't know. Boom, Ek Death. Let's get it. All right, Ek Death. Let's take a second here. Let the lag go away. Yeah, the health did not move that much. <laughs> Oh, well, I tried my best. All right, I guess we'll do the outro here because the other place I want to do the outro is kind of far away. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out the mod. And next episode is our big 30th episode. Again, leave suggestions for it. We want a weapon that will kill everything because we're going to be going against a lot in the next episode. I'm talking about instead of regular vanilla bosses, we're going against eternity mode vanilla bosses. We're going against bosses we haven't fought before from other mods. And then we're going to go against some of the bosses that of course we take on you know the calamity bosses act death of course we gotta have them in there but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the video i'll see y'all next time get ready for the big number 30 episode